Hey YouTube, this is Kevin Bowen of Bowen Small Engine and today I just wanted to do a little small demonstration for you guys as to what I was talking about in my prior video. Um, this is basically the same celluloid that I took apart. Um, I decided I'd put it back together. <laughs> but uh, what I wanted to show you was is the contact points and of course yes this is the starter that I rebuilt in how to uh, rebuild a bridge of Stratton starter. Basically, what you do, what you have in one of these celluloids, I'm sorry, is a contact point between those two posts. And a lot of people don't get a chance to see this, and I thought I'd do a cutaway. This, of course, is the windings. There's a plunger that's on the inside of this. That plunger drives uh, um, this little old top cap, okay, which makes contact with the two poles on each side and that's what actually gives you your current to feed I'm sorry gives you your current to feed through to your starter as you can see right here right here on the start so I'm going to show you guys this this is pretty interesting I'm going to try to see if I can't do this and you'll see that it whizzes pretty good so if you see that see that Every time that does that, there's a, little, there's a little arc there, and that arc, okay, actually affects that celluloid over time, as you can see. I mean, it really spins the starter very well. But I thought I might actually show that to you guys. I figured this would be the best way to uh, actually show you. 